Uh, hi, my name is Eugene Smith, and today I'm here at the uh, Concrete Artisans. I'm going to be talking to Josh Anderson, owner and artist. How you doing, man? Pretty good. How you doing? Doing great. Well, we're going to go in here. We're going to take a look at the showroom and see what uh, the Concrete Artisans do. This is, uh, this is called an imperial, imperial rope edge bolt. Uh, it's done with uh, base color San Diego buff with the same color vein. It's got a natural look to imitate stone. This edge here is a broken flagstone with a San Diego buff base color with a chocolate vein that runs through it to give it the look of stone. This edge here is a uh, grapevine uh, with the same color vein with some different variations of texture that runs through it. This is awesome. These are like this is like 3D. You can have whatever edging. Now, how many different edge types? Well, are 12 there? Twelve different edge molds, but at the same time, sky's the limit. Whatever your mind can come up with, I can I can make. Wow! So someone can have the benefit of you know having something in their mind and being able to put it on their countertop to match whatever it is. You, anything they can imagine, they could have if they really wanted. It. Exactly. Josh, right here is one of your uh, one of your custom concrete countertops, and this is concrete. It's amazing. And what is this? Uh, what is this edge right here? This edge is called imperial rope. Uh, it's where it actually has the vantage on the top of the top that actually rolls over to the edge mold. Kind of gives a three three dimensional look. Kind of gives a natural look of of veins. First, the look of stone. It's awesome. I can't believe it's concrete. It doesn't look anything like the stuff that we uh, walk on outside. Look at this. I'm seeing there's different. Like there's a little pitting in here and veins in the veins here. What is that? Yeah, there's actually, it's considered, a, there's a depth difference there. It's considered a one wipe surface. That way if you spill something, you can still contain the spill with one wipe. Uh, you can request not to have the depth difference to where I can make it perfectly flush for you. Oh, so a customer can have it either smooth or they can have this uh, the depth. You know, yeah. That's awesome. Is there any price difference? No, no difference at all. That's cool, man. And this is like a, it's like a, a work of art, man. Each piece is like a work of art. Yeah. Every, every, every piece is different. That's yeah, so a one of a kind. Right here in Woodbridge, Virginia. Man. Who are the people who buy this type of stuff? What are your, what is your customer? Typically the luxury homeowners with an eye for detail. Yeah. Uh, art collectors, curators, people who love sculptures. Makes sense. Architect designers, interior designers, even people that are a bit environmentally aware. Yeah. But it's, it's green, green, right? Because it's green. Concrete is a green product. Yeah. That's awesome. So looking at that, where else, what types of buildings do you see this type of stuff, man? I think Library of Congress or something when I look at this, yeah, typically a residential. Uh, I haven't made it out to the floor for more, but it would look really good and it would look really good at uh, a uh, museum or something. Look at this, it's beautiful. So there you have it. Thank you for joining me today. My name is Eugene Smith. I was here with Josh Anderson of the Concrete Artisans, and we saw today how you're only limited by your imagination, and anything you want to do with concrete can happen discussed how it's a luxury surface, it's beautiful, you've seen some of the things that can be done with it, and all at a price that's comparable to granite. Thank you very much.